Hey y'all, I'm Robbie, and I'm going to show you how to play If I Didn't Have You by Thompson Square. Uh, I apologize for not putting out any videos at all this month yet. Uh, I've just been busy with school stuff and uh, laptop problems. So, uh, Also, I want to thank everybody for staying subscribing and stuff like that. I, right now, I'm three away from a thousand. Once I reach a thousand, I'll have a separate video for this. Uh, I'll give away probably like a, a new CD coming out of your choice, uh, or a pick of three, like Jason Aldean, Luke Bryan, something like that. So uh, I ain't really decided at this point, but I'll do something. Anyways, uh, here's how you play this song. Uh, capo on your fourth. Unless you're singing, unless your voice is in a different key, then it's okay to take this off. Somebody asked me, is the capo important? Yeah, but people play it sometimes down one, up one, depending on their voice. But for the song, it's played with the on the fourth to match the key. Okay, so uh, what you're gonna need is a B minor, a G, a D, and an A. Okay, so basic chords except for the B minor. It's a little hard if you're a beginner. Uh, if you forget how to do a B minor, uh, you stretch your first finger uh, right here on the second fret relative to the capo all the way and you touch the 6th string because you don't want that to be playing you just touch it with your first finger but you cover the rest of them it should, it should sound like that okay and then you put your 2nd finger on the 2nd string of the 3rd fret and your 3rd, 4th finger on the middle strings right here the 3rd and 4th strings on the 4th fret that's your B minor basically the whole song uh, and at the at the end of the verse and chorus they add a B okay uh, so you're gonna need to know a B uh, B is same thing as a B minor like with your first finger same position but uh, with your third finger you bar the second third and fourth strings on the fourth fret make sure you don't hit that that's the little string you gotta have that barred with your first finger, not your third finger. If you touch it, it's gonna be dead. Okay, okay. Now let's get into it. I broke this lesson down a little bit because I've seen some of people uh, like doing covers of the song, and I see exactly where they're at. So I'm trying to break my lessons down more. Uh, so keep your questions coming, and I'm gonna try to get more in depth with my lessons. I uh, like more for beginners instead of kind of intermediate beginners kind of deal so here we go a B minor and for the strumming I'll, sh I'll tell you what I'm doing I'm going down up down 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 up down okay for the B minor down down up down and then I'm hitting up right right, uh, right as I change and then I'm going to a G down so down, up, down, up, down. Hitting it again as I change. It just gives it the extra dynamic than to a D. Uh, if you bring your thumb around, you can do a D slash F sharp, which I do m mainly now anyway. to an A, down, up, down, up, down, okay, and you can alter that a little bit, you can add a couple in there, this is one of them songs that uh, has no legit strumming pattern, I mean, I'm sure there is one for the song, but you can use a variety, as long as they're close or similar to the one I'm using, uh, and you can, eat, if you're singing it by yourself, you know, you like I said, you can move this thing and you can mute on some places. <laughs> Chorus comes because it's the same uh, strumming pattern. You can stop muting and go. And 
And also, right before you change, you can kind of uh, chop right here the chord to make it stop. And then change chords, okay? That's just an additional thing you can do. You don't have to. Uh, let's see. That covers about all of it, I believe. I'm trying to think of any additional things. Uh, anyway, subscribe right here for me. Don't forget about my giveaway uh, coming up here pretty soon, especially after I reach a thousand. Expected a couple weeks after that uh, is when the competition will be or close and whatever. Anyway, uh, any questions, points, comments, or requests, please leave below. Check out my Facebook fan page. Uh, oh, what was what? What do I usually say here? It's been a while. It's been that long. Oh. Uh, so make sure you subscribe because then you can be part of my giveaway. And I think I'm forgetting something here. Oh yeah, if you want to cover doing this song, you and your significant other, or just you, whatever, which is, I guess it'd be kind of hard. Well, I guess it'll work with one person. Uh, post as a video response. I'll approve it. I'll see what you got. Give you my take on it. All my takes are nice, even if the covers are not superstar worthy I give you friendly advice what you did good stuff like that in my opinion I'm a professional but I like to see what you guys got a lot of you are really good so anyways we'll see you next time